Hey students, today we're going to uh, need a piece of paper and we're gonna count grass. <laughs> it's gonna be fun. All right, let's go outside. All right, students, so I have found a bit of grass kind of near my house within walking distance to my house, a bit of grass that I'm legally allowed to access because we gotta follow governmental guidelines on social distancing and stay at home orders and all that. And uh, here's my question. How many blades of grass are there in this, this patch of grass, okay? And I could, you know, probably look it up on the internet to find like an estimate of the number of blades of grass, but that'd be sort of lame because I've got a piece of paper here. Can't I do it with this? Can't, can't I just figure it out with this? And that's, I guess, my question to you with this assignment. Could a person theoretically figure out an estimate of how many blades of grass there are on a certain area of grass, let's say a 10 by 10 section, could they theoretically do that without counting every single blade of grass in the 10 by 10 section? Well. I want you to try to figure out a way that that could be possible using what you know of mathematics to make the work a lot easier. Because after all, we gotta work smarter, not just harder. Good luck. So, did you figure out a way? Well, let me give you a little bonus question. Figure out another way. Did you figure that out? Try one more. Can you come up with three different ways of estimating as accurately as you can the number of blades of grass in a 10 by 10 chunk of yard somewhere near you? How could you do that?